So in the previous lecture, we have sent one text message using the WhatsApp Cloud API to Postman. Now in this lecture, we'll again do the testing of a sending a text message of through with Cloud API from Postman, but this time we'll add a URL in the body. So if you go to the collection of the WhatsApp Cloud API, the first under messages, first we did the testing with this send a text message okay now we'll make use of this one now we'll make a this uh, make use of this one send a text message with pre url and if you see the body see the the top portion is not going to change okay the endpoint url is same your para, your authorization is also same concept header also same concept based on the type of url your body is going to change every time okay so now this was our last one, send text message. Okay, so under our postman collection, I will make a copy duplicate of this. Send text message. Preview URL. Okay, so here the version is not going to change. Phone number is not going to change. Both this you will get from your developers.facebook slash apps. Version copy from here, V22.0, and your, or do you say the phone ID from here? Okay, the temporary access token copied from here that we have to add inside the authorization, barrier, barrier token, in the headers, content types like JSON and body, which is going to be changed. So again, I will go back here in the send text message with with preview URL. Why oh, it is not giving? Yeah, with preview URL. I just copy this complete body. Okay, I will go here. This is my old one. I will remove completely. I will paste here. Again, I will add the recipient number. Okay, the recipient number is added. Preview URL equal to true. So please visit HTTPS. Okay, I'm not changing here. Let me save this and just passing as it is from the WhatsApp Cloud API collection. I'll click on send button. Let's see how it's going. So here you can see again it is success. I will go back to WhatsApp Business API. See how beautifully. Okay, here it is mentioned. The URL is given. We can click on this. Okay, please visit the X, Y, Z. Let me try some different one. So instead of this, instead of this, I will again make a duplicate of this. Okay, the same one. Let me try my website, some other website. Please visit. I'm just trying. www. Any other website you can try. Please visit for SAP learning videos. Okay, and just click on send. So the spelling is right here. It is giving bad request. Okay, so it is not working. Something is wrong. Was the phone number not allowed in the list? Oh, my number is same. Okay, let me remove this completely. Let me remove this. Hmm. Nine one nine three seven one four one five six four two. Send again. Now I can see success. Go to WhatsApp. Great. Okay. So this time it is not showing that preview. Okay, but first time if you are sending any YouTube videos, it is coming properly. Okay, that is coming properly. Okay, why it is not showing that? Oh, I forget to one second, one second. I will copy as it is because that forward slash is not there, I guess. I forget that. Okay, let me remove this completely from here. 
yeah to forward slash i forget send success go back yeah now you can see the website preview as well okay so very easy sending a whatsapp text message through preview url you can send any youtube video any website okay with your custom message inside it okay so we done with the testing of third api text message with preview url thank you